I was living in darkness. I didn't think there was any other way. You can't determine your fate. It's a real struggle. I started to get scared, but for the right reasons. So there has to be a change. Like, there has to be a change. What do you think the way out of all of this road life? Struggle and halfway, gun crime, got kicked out about three schools, about four colleges, knife crime, was a probation twice, gang banging, tag twice, smoking weed, gang violence, drug jail. Live by the gun, die by the gun. And my head was all messed up and I got in a gang and I felt accepted and secure. Like, like they said, the fear was gone now, I didn't fear no one, I felt like I was the man. Like if you touch me, I'll ring my friends. I wanted to be like the big don in the area, I'll see his watch and his car and I wanted it. Money, girls, power. How can I get that? He told me, yeah, sell drugs. Then, as the older person, he used me. You want to make money? Go sell drugs for me. I could have died. I could have gone jail and not come out. My friend died, and it kind of hit me a bit, and I was just like, oh. And he's gone, in it? We move on, and, and then... I got arrested when I was 15. People tried to kill me. In front of my mum, I was trying, people trying to stab me and that. And people trying to shoot me and sitting at a bus stop. You can test fate if you want, but you're going to lose. How do you think that the youth for today are getting dragged into this kind of system on the road? They just want to be a bad man, and They just want to follow their next friend. They, they ain't got a mind of their own. They just fight. They seem that like fighting the streets is the easy way out, and, that, and it's, it's just all wrong. I've been through situations where the only way out is death, but I managed to get out of it. It's not about focusing on the negativity. It's about focusing on positive things. And, mm. and you know, to learn, you have to make a mistake. And at the end of the day, there's nothing wrong with making mistakes. The change came from a lot of things. The people I had around me was good for me. Like there was one one good example. Colin rang me. Do you want to come football? I said no. And he goes, just come, just come. I said, no. And then one, and, and I ended up going, and I got a phone call. Yeah, one of us got stabbed. If I went there, I would have been stabbed as well, because if my friend's getting stabbed, I'm not going to stay there. You know? I'm not going to stay still, and I'm going to obviously help him. So to me, I see that someone called me to go football. Now, football stopped me from getting stabbed. That's how I see it, or getting involved in a situation. If I go football, I won't be violent in a gang, because I'll be at football. My new gang can be football, do you know what I'm trying to say? It's a family now. And that's what you think a gang is. This is my family, man. Yeah, we ride or die. But you're not. who's going to be there for you? Safety. Being in a gang, you're not safe. You think you are, but you're not safe. You're safe in the, on the road, but then when you shut your door, they're not with you in your bed, you know what I'm saying? Someone could come in your house and kill you. Go to a gang right now, ask them, why would you sell drugs to say to make money? Why do you want money to survive? John, why are you in a gang? Because they're my guys. But then really, if they be honest, they'll tell you that they join a gang because they're scared. My life's changed around, man. I've done a U-turn, man. Man's more positive, man's got a driver license. Man's just finished my plumbing course, got 97%. Man's kicking ball. Man's been in the newspaper seven times. Man's done about four shows. But then I was a gangbanger. I was this, I was you one time, but look at me now. I've been there. I know the, the ups and the downs of it. I'm living proof that hard work pays off, you know? That's the key. Take your opportunities. There's jobs out there. If you want it, you can get it. Just get off the street. Go even to a youth club and that. It's better than being on the street. You don't just think that ganging, banging and being violent is the way forward. Just know that you're just in a little circle. There's a bigger world, you know. The whole world ain't a gang, you know. I thank God for my past because my past made me who I am today.